Earth Month is important to me primarily because it supports the mission of Aveda. Our mission at Aveda is to care for the world we live in. It's our opportunity to do um, serious storytelling. We have this great ability to do good. It transcends normal business. It's the opportunity to truly make a difference in the world. Earth Month is all about clean water efforts around the globe, particularly here in India, where we work with the Global Green Grants Fund. They're focused on the complete uh, ecosystem of how that money is entering into a specific grant, uh, how they're utilizing uh, those funds, how those funds then are sustainable. We've seen unbelievable positive changes happening as we speak in terms of freeing children from ch uh, child slavery and also to give uh, children that live in rural, rural environments clean water to drink every day. It is a direct impact. It's not going a little bit here, a little bit there. I mean, we're directly impacting their lives. When we went to the ashram to meet the children that were involved in child labor, um, some of them even just a short two weeks ago were working in mining. It was like the sun on my face when I, when I saw them. I saw triumphant, strong, amazing human beings. They adorned us with flowers. They. Um, we're so happy to see us, and they treated us like, like we were the heroes, but really, they're, they're the heroes. The flower of our heart is blossoming inside. We are very happy to welcome you. It would sound like something very sad, but I left with a lot of hope. It was amazing when they did the plays for us, and it was amazing when they sang for us, and they were just so happy and they were just so joyful. The hope and the life that they're going to have now is just unbelievably amazing. We take it for granted. Being able to turn the faucet on, being able to take a shower, being able to have the benefit and have the luxury of a clean glass of water at a moment's notice. I was, I was pretty excited to see the completion of this well and the fact that they were going to have clean water because of it. And what I realized in going there was is that building a well was really only one piece of a much broader, um, uh, a broader understanding. So instead of us giving them a well, what I found was the only way to do it was for them to want a well and then for them to make it a sustainable entity within their village. It's not just about raising and giving money. It's really about, it's about embracing uh, cultures and then helping them evolve from where they're at. What it's meant to me, it just, I wish there was a word big enough and there just isn't.